Alrighty, this is Halloween 1978, the original, the OG, the everything, the scary, the, I don't know, Mike, is this Mike Myers or Jason? <laughs> I have no idea. I am a complete noob when it comes to horror, the horror genre. I am terrified just in my daily life, just, just living in this world is scary enough. So I've always thought, I don't need to add to that fear. I am sensitive, but I'm 32. I'm ready to watch these iconic movies. And I just watched Rosemary's Baby. That was freaking awesome. Awesome movie. Like, I, it, that may be one of my favorite movies now. It's like up there in my like best movies I've ever seen. I loved that movie. So I'm hoping that I might actually really fall in love with some new movies that I just like I've stayed away from just because of my like fears. Although I, I am sensitive, so it's the it's just the truth. So I am a sensitive person. Welcome. Welcome if you're new. My name is Iman. And yeah, we're just gonna get through this together. This is Halloween. Jamie Lee Curtis is in this. I, I know that. So I do think then this is Mike Myers. And I don't know, but I don't know the story. I think he's a ghost or a spirit, a, a possessed spirit who just murders people. And I, so I'm pretty sure everyone's going to die in this. <sighs> if I close my eyes, if I do this, it is what it is. I'm, I just, I don't want to lay awake at night. Just re, just seeing these images of people being brutally murdered. I don't want to see it. If that, if, if it, I'll do this, like I'll, you know, I'll do some things that I'm kind of seeing it. I just don't want the image in my head, but damn it. We'll see what I can do. This is Halloween. It's the month of October, so I wanted to do a spooky movie marathon. Um, so I'm trying to get as many movies as I can uh, watched. So we'll see how this all turns out. Maybe I'll be stronger by the end of this. I'm also watching The Haunting of Bly Manor, and I did watch Midnight Mass already, reacted to that. Um, and I got through both of those, so that's good. That's good news, I think I'm getting stronger. And I'm watching Supernatural. And I would say Supernatural is diet horror, so, um, yeah. At least it's like showing me like the, the, the monster of the week type thing, and it's, it's helping a little bit. Even Supernatural is scary for me, so. <laughs> Let's see how this one goes. All right. I'm gonna count down for the full timer, uncut, unedited versions of these reactions that you can find on Patreon if you would like to find them there. Those links are down in my description box below. <sighs> All right, here is nothing, I guess. Let's just do it. Oh. Damn, this is iconic. This is the, the song. John Carpenter's Halloween. <laughs> I do love Halloween. It is like one of my favorite like ho holidays. It is a holiday to me, but. Oh, introducing Jamie. Is this her first movie? Is this her first role? Oh no. It's a small town. I hope kids are safe in this movie. My parents won't be home until 10. Oh, here we go. People, teenagers having sex and then they get killed. I mean, that's always what happens in these movies. Michael's around someplace. <gasps> Michael. Take off that thing. <laughs> okay, so Michael is her brother and he's a creep. He's about to climb up to see what's... I hate that we are like Michael's POV. It's like, we're the creeps. What? Does he think he needs to protect his sister or something? I gotta go. Will you call me tomorrow? Wow, that was quick. As <laughs> that was quick. Well, he's just a kid, isn't he? Oh, God. We're gonna have to blur this. What? Is that not Jamie's character? 
So far, I've been wrong on every account. I thought he was coming there to protect his sister. I thought that was Jamie Lee Curtis. Michael? What? So he was just a kid? What the hell? This is a really crazy story. Like, a kid out of nowhere just stabbing his sister. The driveway's a few hundred yards up on the right. The only thing that ever bothers me is their gibberish. Oh, they're at like a mental asylum. He hasn't spoken a word in 15 years. Are there any special instructions? Don't underestimate it. Don't you think we could refer to it as him? If you say so. I'm also sick, so I really apologize <clears throat> for the coughing. Since when did they let them wander around? Pull up to the main gate. Shouldn't we put... Oh, move. This is... That is creepy. Oh, shit. <laughs> Stop it! You. This is so messed up! What?! They, they're they really... This is all messed up. Oh my god. Oh, he's stealing the car. He's gone. He's gone from here. The evil is gone. <laughs> <laughs> okay so this is jamie lee curtis i thought the girl in the beginning was that was her i have to drop off the key why because he's gonna sell a house why because <laughs> that's his job where the myers house the myers house oh He's already Oh he's already in there. He said awful stuff happened there once. Lonnie Lamb probably won't get out of the sixth grade. Wish I had you all alone. Oh my god. Just the two of us. I think this pisses me off because I just don't understand why this man is so hell-bent on killing and anger and like do we ever get a backstory no matter what course of action collins took he was destined to his own fate <laughs> wow okay that's foreshadowing the story oh shoot oh he's just standing there Oh man, not this kid. Dude. Oh, this is gonna be tough. It's the cast of Stranger Things. Don't you know what happens on Halloween? Yeah, we get candy. <laughs> boogeyman, Ooh, the boogeyman, the boogeyman, the boogeyman. Oh. Why are kids so ridiculous? Oh my gee, God. He's like, just slow down, kid. You might get hurt. Did you see him? He was bullied. Don't mess. Why would you hurt this kid? He smashed his pumpkin. <laughs> what in the world does this guy want? I forgot my chemistry book. So who cares? I always forget my chemistry book and my math book and my English book and my, let's see, my French book. Oh, shit. Hey, isn't that Devon Graham? Who's that? I don't think so. You guys couldn't see inside the car? When you have road rage. <laughs> He's an er reverse. <laughs> So it's like a lot of like creeping POVs. Like, is he there again? Is he just gonna like? Oh, he's she's. Oh. No. How is she not like freaked out? I guess it is Halloween. He wants to take you out tonight. <laughs> she's running. She's like, oh shit. Really? <laughs> I'm standing right there. Poor Laurie. 
scared another one away. Why is she such a jerk? Well, Annie. Home sweet home. That's your See home? You later. She's not seeing you later. Oh, You're dying. Bye. 100% because you're an asshole and Michael is not like a nice guy. Michael is there. He's in the house. <laughs> you know, it's Halloween. I guess everyone's entitled to one good scare, huh? Why is this guy creepy too? Get out of the way, bro. Oh, he's a sheriff. Get out of the way, sheriff. Oh, her windows are open, too. <laughs> no, at this point... At this point, I would be, like, terrified. Hello? Hello? And now he's praying c Colin. Listen, my mother's letting me use her car. I'll pick you up. 6.30. Okay. Bye. It's so crazy how Bye. old they all sound. <laughs> Like they do not sound like they're in high school. Yeah. Judith Myers, Myers. Row 18, plot 20. <laughs> this guy reminds me of Toodles from Hook, but I don't know if that's the same actor. Why do they do it? Goddamn kids. Oh. They do anything for Halloween. 18, 19. Judith Myers. Then Michael is here. Still Are they smoked? smoking weed? I wasn't smoked. I wouldn't. I feel like smoking weed right now is not the best idea. <laughs> when you're paranoid as hell. Boy, stop <laughs> coughing. What's I mean, you can't get rid of the smell. Just be natural. There he is. Just be natural. <laughs> he's gonna smell like a freaking skunk. Like he's like, whoo. Dr. Sam Loomis. Be bracket. I'd like to have a word with you if I could. Well, maybe a few minutes. It's, I've got to take just care. important. Ten he's minutes. right there. I'll be here. He can, and he's got an. If that's his doctor, he's gonna be like, oh shit, he's here. He doesn't even care. Oh my god, he's just like. <laughs> I don't know. It's just funny. It's so cool how they found the mask for Michael. Like, you know, when did they know that this was going to be what he was going to wear? Still warm. He got hungry. What? <laughs> could have been a skunk. Could have. It could, he got hungry? Man wouldn't do that. This is not a man. I just knew that that would be the line. <laughs> This is so funny. I, I mean, I don't, I'm not making fun of the movie. It's just like, I'm sure this scared a bunch of people when they first watched it back in the day. Like when this came out, people were probably like looking over their shoulders like, oh, shoot, we can't trust people in our neighborhood. She, she was sitting right here. Yeah, but he was just a kid. He, how does he even, he wouldn't know what he was doing. Like, he wouldn't know. Standing on the lawn, he could have seen inside. I'm sorry, that was loud. I met this six-year-old child with this blank, pale, emotionless face and the blackest eyes, Jeez. the devil's eyes. I feel like you were the wrong doctor. Go, residents. It's me. Hi, Annie, what are you doing? Making popcorn. I have big, big news for you. Oh, die. Oh, die. Please. Hold on a minute. This German Shepherd better, like, stop Michael. I can't believe it. Oh, man. The poor kid. He sees that. And at least he knows. He's like, this me This is weird. Oh, no. I was like, when does the killing start? Now, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. Lindsay, I need a rope. What? What is this? <laughs> Why she has to get completely naked? <laughs> oh, I dropped popcorn on myself. Here we go. 
Let the dog got out. Get him. Get him. Lindsay, Lester's barking again and getting on my nerves again. She is so frustrating. Come on. No Never way. Mind. I guess you found a hot date. I cannot see what's happening. Oh, no. You choked him out? I feel like the doctor was the wrong doctor for him. Michael needed, like, a, they just should have kept, meet, like, trying to meet new doctors, you know? I saw the boogeyman. I saw him outside. All right. The boogeyman can only come out on Halloween night, right? Right. While I'm here tonight, I'm not about to let anything happen to you. No. Promise? Promise. Can we make the jack-o'-lantern now? She's so great. <laughs> I love her relationship with that kid. Oh, shit. He must be somewhere, like, right over there. He's inside. <gasps> oh! -hoo! The, the doo -doo -doo. What does he tie a, a little string on the, the knob? Oh, this poor kid. Is she gonna get killed? I mean, I don't know what Jason, or <laughs> Michael, not Jason. I, for me, they're the same. I don't know what Michael is capable of. Oh God. <laughs> What? This I I know how this <laughs> I know what the I know how this starts. I am stuck. Oh, that's fabulous. When did they leave? <laughs> About a half hour ago. Oh, utterly fantastic. <laughs> so why don't you just shut the door? God, I've got a shirt on. That's all you ever think about. I think that's all you ever think. That's not true. I think about lots of things. Now, why don't we not stand here talking about them and get down to doing them? You're literally babysitting a kid. As long as the kids are safe, I'm fine. Come on in. We're making a jack-o'-lantern. I want some popcorn. <laughs> no. This is great. This part is doing it for me. Like, where I'm like, where is he gonna, where, where is he popping out from? <laughs> is he in the car? Yeah, he's been breathing in there. <gasps> oh! oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. <laughs> Okay. Jeez. Oh my god. He's just not letting go. <laughs> oh, great. Oh, shoot. Well, now he's seeing something real. And he's holding a body. I found it, Oh, Tommy, stop it. He's getting lazy. He's over that. Tommy, stop it. Now there's Poor no thing can't even talk. I'm not afraid. Bull. I'm not. Then go in. <laughs> what is this guy t waiting for? Hey. Hey, Lonnie. Get your ass away from there. <laughs> This is this he's like, this is how I help. I'll just stand here in the bushes. Oh <laughs> Death has come to your little town, Sheriff. You can either ignore it or you can help me to stop it. More fancy talk. <laughs> and if you are right, damn you for letting him go. <laughs> He's just, I feel like this is a stupid plan just to wait 
here the whole night. Like, if he's supposed to be wandering and going all over the place and killing. Hey, Annie! Annie, we're here! I wonder where they went. Okay, hey, let's look for a note. Let's do it. You guys, this is not even Annie's house. It's like the Lindsay's parents' home. Oh, God. <laughs> Everybody's having a good time tonight. <laughs> All right, you guys, what's next? Perspective, right? You have no idea what's going on. Hey, is Annie around? No, I thought she'd be home by now. She went to pick up Paul. Well, she's totally not here. Have her call me when she gets home, though. I have Lindsay here, and I want to know what time to put her to bed. Lindsay is gone for the night. Hey, now that's wonderful. <laughs> that's all she got from that message. Where Annie is missing. And they're doing it in the parents' bed. Jeez, I guess when you're a teenager, the hormones are wild. Oh my god, no, I hate it. Why why in their most vulnerable time? Like I can't. I thought Annie might be in the fridge. You can hear him breathing. Okay, Linda. Come on out. <gasps> oh, shit. That would be so scary. This guy just chokes people. He's strong. Oh, my God. Yeah, he's extremely strong. And there's the knife. Ugh. What? He got, he's pinned him. Oh my God. Yeah, I mean, this guy is like out of his mind for sure. Oh my God, no freaking, I mean, he at least has a sense yeah, of humor. My beer? No, this guy doesn't just stare off into space. They're acting like he doesn't, someone like him would not put on a, <clears throat> a ghost a costume. That's funny. He's, he's, he, there's a lot of things going on up there. This is going nowhere. Oh, shoot. Hello? Uh, 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 Hello? Uh, uh, <laughs> All right. She's hey, like, I okay. I get your famous chewing, now I get your famous squealing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it does sound like she's having sex. I'll kill you if this is a joke. <laughs> Oh no. Sleep tight, kids. No. She's she's a really good character. Like I I like her. I like that she's taking care of the kids. Linda? Bob? <laughs> yeah, like how she shuts the door behind her. I mean, that's smart. Most definitely stop being funny now. Cut it out. I'd be sorry. <laughs> Are they going to be all like stacked on top of each other? Oh, man. That's pretty creepy. Yeah, that would be crazy. Oh. <laughs> I love when the stuff like this happens. It's funny. Then she's just gonna tumble. Oh shit. <laughs> you gotta get out of there. I know if they're your friends, I get that. That's it's terrifying, but you Oh he's right! Oh my god! Oh don't let him grab you by the neck. Oh shit. Oh if he grabs her by the neck, it's over. Open What is up? 
How did the door get stuck? It's not jammed. At least she's like putting up some fight, you know? He stuck. Oh, he put a rake in front of the door? Oh my god. You're gonna have to do the same thing. Break through the glass. Push the rake. Oh my god. God. And it's Halloween too, so people are just like, is this a joke? God, that's terrifying. Oh my god, this would probably be I think this is the scariest part because I really truly believe if this happened in real life, most people would not open up their doors. Like it's just the truth. Oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, the boogeyman! <laughs> it's the boogeyman, bitch! Hurry! Oh, Lord, Tommy. Why do you have to turn the lights off? No. He's... How much... God, this guy has way too much time on his hands. Oh, no. He's already in? Oh, jeez. Is a knitting? Okay, good. Needle. Get him. Get him. That's right. One more. Another one. Just another one. Another one. No. We need to keep stabbing this guy. Oh, good. She's got the knife now. No, he's not. I would have you have to keep getting this guy. <laughs> this is the doctor. I'm so annoyed by this doctor. He's ridiculous. Like literally, he he needs help himself. Like he's not fit to be a doctor. Tommy, Lindsay. Oh, good. They're okay. Oh. I'm scared. There's nothing to be scared of. Are you sure? How? I killed him. Oh my god, bitch. He's behind me. <laughs> Get in there. Come on, Tommy. No, no, Fuck no. this guy. I would beat him up. Like, you don't mess with the children. How does this help? Like, he knows you're in here, so he's gonna look around. I don't understand. Punch through that. Yeah, like, what are you doing? I mean, how do... <laughs> yeah, I mean, makeshift weapon, I guess. Oh, really? In the eye? Get... Ooh. One more. You gotta do it again. This guy... <laughs> I mean, isn't there like... There's like 10 Halloweens, right? <laughs> so he doesn't die. Stomp on his face. She keeps dropping the knife. That's crazy. I want you to go down the stairs and out the front door. And I want you to go down the street to the Mackenzie's house. And I want you to tell them to call the police. And you go too. This is crazy. So what is this? What is he? Is he... He's a zombie. He's a demon. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ball kick him. Knee him. Oh, she almost got the mask off. Oh. Oh, interesting. So he just, he's like a demon because he never, like, he never dies. Man, the 
trauma that she will carry with her. Was the boogeyman? As a matter of fact, it was. <laughs> this is not reassuring. <laughs> he just sucks. This guy should not be a doctor. He's gone. So he's got a bulletproof vest because there is no reason. He is the boogeyman. I need I need to understand the backstory. Like what is Michael supposed to be? You just hear him all the time just breathing. <laughs> Halloween. <laughs> A John Carpenter film. <laughs> They're talking the general trivia. Why how did Michael Myers know how to drive a car? It's like, well, when Dr. Loomis drove Michael to sanity hearings over the years, Michael simply watched very closely and carefully as Dr. Loomis operated the car. Remember, even if Michael sat in the back seat and there was a screen of bulletproof glass partition, Michael could still look over the doctor's shoulder without Loomis realizing the significance. And I guess in, the ha in Halloween, the curse of Michael Myers, it provides a retroactive explanation to this question. I mean, it seems like I'm going to have to just watch more of these movies because I have a lot of questions. It's like, because he's a, he was just a child. He was a six-year-old kid who killed his sister. Did he have signs of doing this before? Was he killing other little, like, insects or animals, critters? What, what the hell? Like, his parents were just like, Michael? Michael? I, I don't know. I just, I don't buy that, you know? Like, for me, I always, I, I look into why, like, people do things. And I understand that this is probably not a movie that's, like, about that. It's just, like, a, a thriller, like, kill, like, slasher flick. It's not about the why. It's just, like, this is a movie. But it's for me, I'm just kind of like, I have, I always have questions like, what the heck, why, where, how, who, what? Um, yeah, I mean, this guy is not a guy. And then like, he had like, his eye was all messed up on one side. Is there some deformity going on? But that doesn't explain what he is or who he is other than he's pure evil. He's got black eyes like the devil. So maybe he is the reincarnation of the devil? Is that what they're trying to say? I mean, if that's the case, then okay, fine. I guess I, I'll have to buy that. But yeah, other than that, that's kind of crazy how he just cannot die. But I think I will say it again. If he had a different doctor, he probably would be better off. Because yeah, this doctor is ridiculous. He's He is a joke and he met him when he was six and he and there was no changes and he kept on who knows what he was doing and they, they people should have said okay something's going on i mean they sent the kid to a mental asylum at six for this i feel like that's not the right answer to something like this like that i just you know like kids honestly genuinely six years old you're not gonna know, like, especially if you're a, just a kid who's growing up in Western society, what death is, because that's not like a thing that's taught. It's like kids watch um, uh, TV shows about killing and video games. They don't understand the significance of, of, of taking a life. They don't know what that is. Unless again, like this is just the devil reincarnate and he's, that's that's what it is and he's, He's come back to wreak havoc on everybody. But the, the fact that it just started at six years old and the parents just sent him off. I I mean, I guess at, some, at that point, yeah, if your kid murders someone at six years old, what do you do? I just feel like there should be way more answers, like better help. Like there's just more that needed to be done here. 
And I feel like Loomis is a big part of why Michael is the way he is now. Because now it's like, yeah, it's a little, I think it's too late. I don't think we can have a talk with Michael. <laughs> Say, Michael, what happened to you? Like, he's, he's, he's gone. Now he's gone. But they could have had a chance at six years old if they, found, if they actually found someone that was helpful, figured out what was going on. And like, yeah, it just makes no sense. It's interesting. It's an interesting movie, though. It's not as scary as I thought it was going to be, which I appreciate. Um, so, like, even with um, Rosemary's Baby, it wasn't as scary as I thought. So, I'm, I'm, it's everything's lighthearted. So, <laughs> this is lighthearted. So, I'm going to jump into some, I guess, darker things. And, like, that's when I'm kind of, like, you know, nervous. About, but... I, I liked this. I think it's fun. I think like when this first came out, it was probably like huge. But now watching this in 2022, it's not like it's not as, you know, it's kind of funny. There's some funny, uh, cheesy parts and I but I appreciate it. I'm glad I actually watched it. And so now I have like, I mean, there's two things they did right in this. The song, iconic, fantastic, perfect the michael myers mask outfit knife and him being super strong that is just the vision there on like how that has affected our culture for years i mean people still dress up as michael myers people still like it's 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 a it's a phenomenon so i i think that's awesome i think jamie lee curtis was fantastic great um and you know, like the cliche teenagers, the horny teenagers who are stupid, drinking and having, you know, just self-absorbed. That was great. There were some really cool moments. And I think the con the, the conversation in the beginning when, when Lori's character was in school, in class, and they were talking about fate. This is what fate is. You can't run away from fate. It, it was like, I guess this is Lori's fate, <coughs> but, <clears throat> yeah, that's it. I really enjoyed this. I'm going to get into another horror movie right now. So I will see you guys there. Um, thanks so much for watching with me. Bye, guys.